Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at cattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Little Red Riding Hood. I'm going to put two fingers at the top in the center and put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a circle. I come back to the dot and I draw a curved line to the left. Come back to the dot, curve line to the right. Inside I put one dot, two dots, little straight line up, little straight line down, and right underneath I draw a circle. And I'm going to color that circle in right now so I don't forget because this is when Little Red Riding Hood probably sees the big bad wolf for the first time. Okay, I go back to the first dot I made and I come up and I make a little second dot. I go towards the left, I draw a curve line down, curve line in, curve line out, and stop. Come back to the second dot, draw me a curve line down, curve line in, curve line down, stop. Come back to the left, we're going to draw a curve line in and a curve line up. On the right hand side, we're going to draw a curve line in, curve line up, connect. Starting over here on the left hand side, I draw a little curve line on the left and a little curve line on the right. I come back on the left and I draw a straight line, curve line down on the left, straight line, curve line down on the right. Come back to the left and we're going to draw curve line on the bottom, curve line on the top. Now we come back on the left and we draw a big curve line over, connect. Come back to the top line and we're going to mimic that line again. We're going to draw a little curve line down, connect on the left, and a little curve line down, connect on the right. Starting on the left, I'm going to draw a wavy, 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 wavy line over. To the right, I'm going to draw another wavy, wavy, wavy line over. Connect. Inside, I draw little curved lines that are going to overlap each other. Little curved lines inside. However many you can fit. Okay. Now I come back here to the center and I draw a straight line down, curve line out on the left, and on the right hand side I draw a straight line down, curve line out on the right. Come back to the left and connect the two with a slightly curved line. Now on the left I draw one, two, three straight lines, come into the left again and draw a little curved line, connect, on the left and a little curved line connect on the right. Come back to the left, draw a big curve line out, up. On the right hand side, big curve line out, up. If you have room, you can add another little curve line and another curve line. Okay, that looks like it's pretty right on the money. Okay, let's see how we're going to color her in. Okay, the most important part, of course, is her Little Red Riding Hood. So this is all going to be red. And then I came all the way down and I made her little soles on her shoes red also. Okay. Then I made her shoes black. I made her basket yellow. I made her little cookies brown in here and I made her dress or skirt brown also. I came up and I made her hair, this is her hair, I made this brown also. Now if you have an apricot or a flesh color you can do her hands, her face, 
and her legs. Kind of an apricot, a peach, or if you don't have that, you can use pink, or you can just leave it alone and leave it white. Okay, let's see what she looks like all colored in. Here's little Red Riding Hood all colored in. Looks like she's looking at the big bad wolf. Okay, bye-bye.